Hello, hello, my beautiful Scorpios, and welcome into Dragonfly Spirit. My name is Mia. Today, we are going to sage a little bit, okay? Um, I just want to let you guys know that this is strictly a Scorpio channel. Um, we do shadow work. I do daily messages every day. And this particular channel is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. So even if you were not born in between these dates, if, if it is in your placement, you are still able to watch this reading and let it resonate with you. Also, some of you could be a cross watcher dealing with this little dangerous thing that is very vengeful sometimes. Listen, we can be vengeful. It fucking happens, you know? I'm not even trying to sit up here all high and mighty saying that, you know, people can't be vengeful, all right? So here we go. We're going to sage a little bit for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Aren't these pretty? I got these from Amazon. A little pricey, but I don't know. I didn't even want to burn them. I'm, I've had them for about, I would say about a year. <laughs> and I had them in a box because I bought three of them. And I decided that I was going to use it today. You know, cleaning up everything, cleaning up the energy. Okay, we are going to see what daily messages come in for you today, Scorpio. For anybody that is looking to book a reading, whether you are a Scorpio or not, everything will be found in the description box below. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what we have for you here. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We already got one out and we have here message in a bottle. So some of you could be waiting for somebody to write something to you, maybe text you. Um, cause it was, it would have, would have been nice, right? Back in the past, if you could have gotten a little message in a bottle. Okay. Um, all right. So here we go. Please universal energies, spirit guys. I feel like some of you are waiting for this news to come in. Um, or you could be delivering the news. Okay. So take it as it fits. Um, you, you also have here new life. So some of you are just waking up from this long nap, okay? You have been thinking, you have been processing, I'm hearing, um, in how to create something better for yourself. Please universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. For those of you that haven't subscribed, please take the time to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Okay, every day, daily messages for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, or cross watchers. Um, okay, so we, you have here never-ending story. Some of you are tired. <laughs> you're tired. You're exhausted. You're like, are you coming at me with this again? Oh, my God, not this again. You know, and I just saw 333. Um, so you also have here unfinished symphony. Some of you are dealing with someone in a situation where something is yet not finished. Remember we talked about that in my last, I don't know if it was Sunday, um, it could have been yesterday. Um, you know, when things are not meant to be, there is nothing that you can do to change it, you know, because the universe has a way of bringing people together parting people, you know, when it's time. And there is something here that has not yet been completed for some of you, okay? But some of you, I'm gonna tell you, you're, you're like, I wanna go on to a new life. I'm ready for, I'm hearing the word vitality, you know? So for some of you, listen, this this could be something, you know, that's, that's awakened in you, okay? Um, all right, so let's see. I'm going to be pulling a reading. Some of you, I don't feel that you want to do this over again. There's somebody here that is tired. There's somebody here that is exhausted. Okay, the you get, the, okay, so here we go. You got three of them. You got here the, the Hierophant, the Ace of Wands, 
Some of you, I'm going to tell you, you're looking for something new, okay? Ace of Wands and the new Wands, you're looking for something that's going to give you some passion. You know, this is, I don't know, I heard the word vitality before, so this is also passion, okay? So you have here um, the Queen of Swords. Listen, for some of you, I'm going to tell you, it's going to be time to... Um, I'm hearing redirect, you know, make a decision. The decision needs to be made, whatever it is. Um, some of you are going to feel as though you have been put in a bad place. You know, some of you have, have had a broken heart because with the queen of swords, this woman or man has a broken heart. They've gone through a lot. They have suffered. Okay. The Queen of Swords always starts out as the Queen of Cups. You know, she's loving and caring until something goes wrong. And then she becomes this hard rock. And it could be a he. You become this hard rock where you're just like, I'm not going to love again. And if I love again, it's going to be my way. And if I love, it's going to be very easily, you know. Sometimes you could teach yourself how to love people a little less. You know, like I said, make a list of all the things that you like about that person and that you don't like about that person. And, you know, go into that and see if you want that to be part of your new life. Okay. Um, you also started out here with the Hierophant. Okay. So some of you are teachers, guides, you're helping other people. Um, with the Hierophant, I'm going to let you know that some of you may also be in a committed relationship, okay? Um, you know, when, when the Hierophant pops up, it's usually like a togetherness between two people. You know, as you can see, this is the two people here, okay? And there's the person. Some of you, I'm going to tell you, you could be teaching other people, um, you know, the ways of life is what I'm hearing. So let's see, why is the Hierophant here? Why is the Hierophant here? But I'm going to tell you, some of you could be in a marriage where there's something here that is not finished, you know? And the problem is that there's somebody here that's waking up from a nap because they want something with passion, something that they can feel right. Okay, so here comes the broken heart with the three of swords. Like I said before, this person, you know, I feel like this person betrayed you. They betrayed your, I'm hearing your confidence. Um, they betrayed, they stabbed you in the heart, you know. Um, three of swords. This is being in a very hurtful place. This is having your heart cracked open. Some of you are suffering over the loss of something is what I just heard. Um, why is the three of swords here? Three of swords, why is it here? Three of swords. Nine of swords. Some of you are biting your nails at night. You are not able to sleep. You feel like the world is watching you. I want you to see all the eyes on this woman, you know, as she sits in her bed, covered up, you know, um, acting as if though she doesn't want to let anyone in. Why? Because she's been broken. This is somebody who's been broken. Some of you have been broken you know, in a situation that you have not been able to surpass, you have not been able to fix, is what I'm hearing. Um, why is the Nine of Swords here? Nine of Swords, why is it here? Please, Universal Energies. Nine of Swords, why is it here for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energies. Ooh, okay. I got a couple on the floor. Hold up. I, th I think it's only one. Oh, goodness. All right, here we go. Um, all right, so here we go. We have here three cards. These are the ones that fell out. Emperor. 
Okay, it's time to do what you need to do to take care of this situation. It's time to put your, your boundaries in place. It's time to make certain decisions. It's time to act as if you, and I just saw 1010. Um, it's time to, it's just time. It's time to step it up. You know, some of you could have been dealing with this person, you know, this put, person could have been like, you know, I'm picking up, I just heard their way or the highway, you know, this could have started out as something that was passionate in your life and it just turned to shit. I, I don't even know what else to say, I, I, you know, and here we go. Listen, look at this. I want you to see this. Five of cups and five of wands. Listen, this was filled with so much fuckery. This was filled with so much bullshit. <laughs> this is crying your eyes out, regretting the situation, feeling a sense of loss. Some of you are still going through that, you know? Some of you don't know how to let this go. Um, you also have here the five of wands. Okay, there could be some jealousy here. You know, listen, it's time to start a new beginning. That's what I'm hearing. It's time to let this bullshit go. Why is the five of cups here? Why is the five of cups here? For Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. There's somebody here that's holding on for dear life. <laughs> There's somebody that's holding on. You know, I'm just feeling that some of you are looking for that brand new life. You're looking for something different. You're looking for something, you know, but this situation has you still on the tip of your, of your toes. You're still standing there, you know. Um, why is the five of wands here? Please, universe. Oh, wait, we have one that's turned here. Oh, we have like four. All right, let's see what these say. Oh, my God, there's five. Scorpio, you're killing me. I was like, I'm going to make this. Okay, these are not turned over. So I'm going to take only the ones that were turned over. Okay, so you have here the nine of cups. It's time to find your happiness. Listen, concentrate on the things that you love to do. Concentrate on who you like to spend time with. You know, there's also here the four of swords. Listen, some of you need to stop investing. And I feel like that's going to be a decision that's going to be made. You know, you're going to, some of you have come a long way on this journey. And I feel that some of you are finally going to say, I'm not going to do this again. I want you to see this. Not again, not this again. I don't have the energy for this. You're not going to have the energy for this. You know, this situation left you, um, let's see right here. This situation has left you broken. Okay, and that's what I'm hearing. That's how I'm hearing. It left you broken, you know? And I feel like some of you, listen, some of you are going to try to find some help. Okay, so you also have here the nine of wands and the four of cups. Okay, so I feel that even though some of you are still deep in your emotions, you're still not over this, this is being highly disappointed. Some of you are kind of understanding that, the, you know what? The only way to go from here is up, Scorpio. With the nine of wands, it's time to heal. It's time to find your strength. It's time to retrieve from whatever no longer is for you. You know, why is the queen of swords here? Queen of swords, why is it here? Queen of swords. Queen of swords, why is it here? King of pentacles and the three of pentacles. I'm going to tell you, some of you are going to meet someone. You know, you're going to meet somebody. This person... You know, for others of you, I'm going to tell you right now that you are going to try to decide that it's time to take care of yourself. You know, with the three of pentacles, I feel like you are going to have to make a decision about working with other people. Okay, in order for you to get to a better place. 
you know, but however, I don't know. Let's 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 see if I can get one. I'm gonna clarify unfinished symphony and never ending story. Okay, so that we can see a little deeper on this. The Sun and the Five of Pentacles. All right, so listen up. Somebody here left you out in the cold. You know, this person, you got another five here. Okay, so for some of you, let me tell you, this is this is being in the brink of crazy. Okay, I don't even know what to say. You know, this is having some sort of way. Some of you are truly feeling abandoned by this situation. I'm going to tell you, some of you need to find some help. Go talk to a priest. Go talk to somebody, you know, important if you are having that type. Listen, book a reading, okay? The, hier the Hierophant is also, um, you know, spiritually connected, okay? So with the sun, Okay, with the sun, listen, like I said before, there's no where else to go but up. Okay, some of you have already been through the worst. The worst has already happened, Scorpio. The worst has already happened. That's what I'm hearing. You know, so I feel that for those of you, you know, push through this portal Push through because there's another life here that's coming in for you. For those of you that closed the chapter to whatever, you know, and I'm hearing healing. Some of you need to heal. Some of you need to stop going through anxiety. Stop rethinking. Stop obsessing over the situation. What is meant for you in life will not pass you by. I promise. You know? All right, so listen up. I am going to leave this here, you know, go into healing, meditate, um, do some journaling as well. I'm hearing take some rest, hydrate yourself, you know, because there is a new beginning coming in here for you. But you need to heal this in order to start your new chapter. Because if not, you're going to just take the broken pieces and you're going to start this new life with broken pieces. Okay? So listen, I'm going to leave this here, my loves. Thank you so much for being here and take care.